Hello and welcome everyone to this auction video of this lovely Vauxhall Vivaro people carrier van on a 69 plate with a full service history and uh, yeah a very nice drive it is indeed very handy lots of seats all looking in good order could do with a little bit of a clean up in here but we've got loads of seats and we've also have the benefit of that very important load area as well so yes uh let's have a have a walk around I took a load of photos i actually took a load of photos when it was nice and sunny so uh yeah the photos don't really tie up to the video but yeah here it is and uh, i just thought i'll give you a walk around and we can uh, study its condition not the best conditions today but hopefully the rain will hold off so i'll try and make this a quick one before it does rain again we've got a few marks here and there a few little light scratches nothing really much just jumping out damage wise though front end is looking clean and tidy with a few stone chips here and there a few stone chips on the bonnet but nothing really crazy going on a little bit of a uh, a scuff here just a bit of cobweb um and uh yeah all looking good i'm just going to turn off that air con because i've got the back open so yeah we've got air con we've got reversing cameras sat nav etc i'll take you through all that in a sec so let's have a look we've got a little bit of uh, a scratch there on the mirror just some light scratching on that front panel your typical wear and tear i would say and again some light scratches on the passenger door your usual kind of wear and tear around the door handles a few little chips there on the door openings as you would expect and again your usual wear and tear around the door handles again a few light scratches nothing really much and not very deep at all uh tail lights are looking good can't see i can see any cracks there that one's looking good as well let's come around to this one all looking good again a few light scratches on those lights but no cracks that i can see so that's all looking good and nice clean and tidy as well in the back there uh come around to this uh, rear quarter panel we've got a bit of a scratch on here and another little scratch here sorry it's got a bit dirty from my road test but no it's uh it is what it is and a few more scratches around here and your usual kind of wear and tear on the door driver's door a few light scratches a few more light scratches but nothing really heavy this mirror is looking nice so let's have a look in the back we've already kind of seen it will be thorough so the door is up as you can see and it supports its weight no problem and we've got a nice big load area there which is really useful as we know for such a vehicle so let's get that closed down and no uh, problem with the operation of the doors or anything like that as well just check this side door but yeah no problem there at all and we've got your seats there as i said could just do with a, a little bit more cleaning but um nothing really a bit of a clean won't sort out and uh, yeah you've got your own temperature controls for the back here but all looking very clean and tidy and presentable and let's come around to this side and that one opens up as well absolutely no problem at all with any of that and all looking good there we've got a little bit of the rubber seal hanging down here but that's a quick easy fix coming around to the uh, passenger door here door card looking in good order windows good we've got electric windows here up front they work no problem and uh, yeah lots of service history full service history i think i'm missing one invoice so we'll add that um to this to the listing sorry and any photos and uh, yeah all stamped up book let's go around to the driver's side oh i haven't really looked at this back door yeah there's a few marks on the back door um again no that's just some cobweb so yeah just a few like marks there markedly in that area on the back door all right so let's have a look on the driver's side again door car is open or door car <laughs> the car door is open i'm sorry this could just do with a little bit more cleaning again it's been clean but it's been uh, got a bit dirty and wet in the rain here uh electric window works absolutely fine and the electric mirrors work as well which is nice just check the other one yeah that's working fine as well so let's hop in and uh yeah we've got all of our 
the usual bits and pieces. So let's turn that brightness up. There we go. You can actually see what's going on here and turn these lights off. So we've got a mileage of 85,601 miles. Take the handbrake off and we've got no warning lights, which is nice to see. And uh, it comes with two keys, which is all good. And both keys seem to be in uh, good order. I'll just do another start up again and uh, we can check for any warning lights together. Hold on a sec. Maybe not that key, it doesn't like that key. Oh, there we go. So it doesn't like one key, but it okay, it's okay with the other. So I'll just try that again. Yeah, no problem with that key. But the other key, maybe it needs... No, it doesn't like that other key. So one key is 40 by looks of it, and the other key... It starts first time every time. So yeah, 140 key by the looks of it. I don't know if it needs a battery or something's wrong with it. Um, but yeah, no warning lights. Um, we've got your infotainment system here. And we've got your uh, sat nav, which all appears to be uh, working fine. No problems with any of that. And we've got a reversing camera as well with sensors as well, no problem with that. And uh, yeah, we've got air calm, that does work. I've just had it on because it was all steamed up in here. And that works fine as well. Um, although I didn't check the coolant, uh, how cold it was running, sorry. You've got stop start as well, and cruise, which is really nice. And uh, yeah, we've got six speeds and the eco setting. Right, okay, getting over to the service history. I think it, I might need to put a stamp in because I know it's been serviced only just. So, you know, I will um, make sure it is all stamped up. But we have got a stamp here, 2019, 2020, 2021, 2022. I'm pretty sure there's one to go in there as well. So I'll do that and put that up on the listing. And we've got some invoices here. We don't have all of them, but I have most of them. Uh, one there for a service back in 2020. And another one there for a service again in 2019. And another one there for 2021 uh, for uh, brakes as well as well as a service and another there 2021 for a compressor uh, at a quite a hefty bill so yeah nice to have that under the um, under your your belt as such so yeah nice uh, a bit of MOT there but yeah all good let's have a look under the bonnet and have a little look and listen uh, but I've already had a look and listen as so I was taking some photos and I couldn't really hear or see anything in toward. But I want to show you, obviously. Let's have a look. Get this bonnet up. All good there. I think we've got some, uh, just a few bits and pieces in there. Right, let's have a look under the bonnet. I'll do it one handed. Yes, okay. So, yeah, it's not too dirty under here. Quite clean and tidy, really. I've not touched it. Uh, it's a very honest car, and you can see that it's been done. And uh, yeah, be quiet and let me have a little look and listen. There we go, guys. A rather nice and quite sought after Vauxhall Vivaro people carrier. Thanks for watching and happy bidding.